SABC News Prime Time. The National Assembly will make history next month when members invoke uh, Section 89 of the Constitution. This relates to any constitutional breach by the President. MPs will debate whether an ad hoc committee should investigate President Jacob Zuma's handling of the Sudanese President Omar al-Bashir leaving South Africa. The motion for the debate was tabled by the Democratic Alliance. The official opposition has been at it for years. Attempts by its former parliamentary leader Lindy Mazibugo between 2012 and 2014 to debate the president's competence never made it through the door. But now the party finally got its way. The National Assembly will consider how al-Bashir was allowed to leave the country despite a court order to arrest him and if an investigation is warranted. It will be the first time ever that Section 89 is being invoked, which is an impeachment of the President. And what this requires you to prove is that the President has breached the Constitution, the laws of South Africa, and his oath of office. Uh, obviously, we've never had uh, concrete proof of that before, which is why we've always had to rely on a 102 um, an motion of no confidence in the President. But the ANC is confident that a party which couldn't win at the polls won't dominate opinion in the National Assembly. Whether it's Section 89 or uh, Section 102 of the Constitution that deals with motion of no confidence, there's no difference. Uh, both of them warrants that uh, Parliament must schedule them, must debate them. But at the end, they will be thrown out of the window because they are nonsensical. The debate is scheduled for Tuesday, September the 1st. Lukaino Tralada, SABC News, Parliament.